More national attention today on the fallout surrounding UH head football coach Greg McMacken's use of a gay slur. And my position coach, who clearly hadn't heard yet, yells out loud from probably 40 feet away while this kid's down on all fours, yeah, this is Sims' favorite drill. On, on the issue, though, Sarah, of, of sports yeah. and its attitude towards gay athletes, uh, even gay journalists in the locker room, as opposed to what's felt yeah. out there generally in society, is there still a gap? Gay and lesbian participation in professional sports has become a point of discussion and controversy. Not even the sheltered community of Muhlenberg College is safe from the discrimination that comes with being a gay male in the macho world of competitive sports. Scott Reuter, an out male on the track team, can attest to this struggle. The guys during an app circuit decided to play How Do I Know Your Bag? And they specifically did not say anything to me. They went to every single person on the team except for me. I said, well, like, as an open gay man, I don't really find games like this conducive to team bonding. I know the other teams, the other guys' teams, they're very hyper-masculine and from how they portray themselves it's very much about getting as many girls as possible and portraying that machismo type of guy where you want to be the ladies' man and do it at all costs and basically from my experience, a lot of the guys on the football team and maybe the lacrosse team are kind of pricks in that sense. If somebody makes a weak hit, they'll say like, what are you, like a fag or something like that, but that, that doesn't really happen that much. Or like, if somebody's complaining about their body, or if they think they're fat, somebody like may say like, oh, you're a fag or something like that. Um, but it's kind of like the military, it's like, don't ask, don't tell. Like, I, I don't know of any gay people on the, on the team. If someone were to come out on the football team, um, I don't, I personally would think that that's good for them, like, they sh should feel comfortable doing that. Um, I could imagine other people on the team probably being uncomfortable with it, but I'm, they, nobody would voice their opinion on that, so. Hopefully, there will only be more integration between the gay community and the world of sports. This collaboration can only lead to progress for gay members of society to seek equal rights and treatment from their peers.